flooded with two feet of snow. The consequence of closing schools, well, nobody could know. Unaware, we marched outside, all bundled nice and warm. And that magic muffled silence was the calm before the storm. It started sweet, we trudged our feet through snow up past our knees. Snowflakes would come upon our tongue, we'd catch them as we please. No one knows who threw one first, though some people blame me. But that snowball heard round the world went down history. A perfectly packed snowball lobbed in a graceful arc. Soared unseen against gray skies, it neatly hit its mark. We heard the thud on Jacket's hood, we watched the target fall. And when he rose, culprit unclear, he promptly blamed us all. If I had known, if I'd thrown the target, I would switch. The ball to fall, he played baseball, and by God, could he pitch. He shook himself angry and cold, and got up off the ground. He threw out seven snowballs, and seven kids went down. Out of snow beside the street was a snow fort ready made. We fled behind those battle men, and battle plans were laid. We packed ourselves an arsenal, each packed tighter than the last. While running out like minute men, the armies were amassed. Like Paul Revere, the horde is clear, went out through Middlesex to come and fight in the world wide by call, by word, by text. Thus began an earnest, what is known forevermore in the state of Massachusetts as that great snowball war. Yes, I'm aware it's coming. It was brother against brother. My older brother won. And after what Jimmy did, it was father against son. The boys from south of town, well, they brought us to a halt. Till we marched to Atlantic Market and we sowed their snow with salt. We held the park till it was dark, then got a little sleep. But with the first light came back to fight every day for the next week. We dug ourselves deep trenches and put them well to use. And unlike in less savage wars, there was no Christmas. I saw so many things I'll never see again. Rough riding sleds take a hill, remember the water main. The sneak attack on Pearl Street, we're living in for me. And I still wake up screaming some nights thinking about Charlie. War still there though, undeclared in that New England town. We get the urge to have a surge whenever snow comes down. Now there's global warming, but we see some snow again. Maybe God is telling us this war has got to end. <laughs>